everybody, welcome back to the channel. And here we have, well, it's a 1999. 1999? Yeah. You're nervous. Let's go. 1999. Can you get it going or what? That sounds weird. That sounds weird. 1999. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today, well, we have a 1999 R34 GTR V-Spec. And, um, well, I'm pretty excited. On a time, and we just couldn't get it right. I wish somebody would have told me that everything would change. I'm finally seeing it clear, and I know just what you are. I wish somebody would have told me that the bed feels warmer than it ever did when you were. So guys, the R34 GTR is powered by the RB26. Now obviously, this one this one is actually legal, even though um, they're not quite legal yet under the 25 year old rule, but uh, this one's getting ready to go in for E85. When it is on E85, it should be making around 600 horsepower. So this one right now has bolt, full bolt-ons. Um, we got a nice diffuser in the back. We got an HKS exhaust and some carbon fiber bits kind of all over. So there was only a handful of these V-Specs that have been legally imported so far, and we're lucky enough to have one today. And it, she sounds good, guys. She sounds real good. And, uh, well, let's show you. So guys, this is my first time in an R34 GTR, besides you letting me sit in this. I've never ridden in one, so I'm pretty excited. I'm excited. This too. is like this is like a dream car for most people, so. Yeah, it is. So, let's do it. Let's see. This is, um, this is all hype right now. This is all hype. are great. What blow-off valve is that? Uh, HKS Super Sequential. HKS blow-off valve. Yes. I guess I could have guessed that. It is a Skyline, so, you know. So, this is kind of, uh, Kind of like surreal almost because it's like I'm in an R34 GTR, so it's kind of like the pinnacle of all skylines. Uh, that, I mean, that's what people would pretty much call it. It's like the pinnacle of all skylines. Yeah, I, I agree. <laughs> um, so how how did you come to get this car? Uh, 2007. I I signed a contract. Um, with baseball, it's my like to go play pro, and um, they shipped me off to Eugene, and I got like my money come in. I got on Google and I uh, found a company that was in Miami that was doing importing um, of Skylines and right-hand drive uh, cars. So um, I called the number up. I got one set up to have it shipped over from Japan and. Uh, at the time, they were doing illegal VIN numbers. Um, There's a lot of a lot of companies were doing the illegal VINs. Mm -hmm. The guy, uh, the guy's company sent me over the one that I originally ordered. It was black, black and gold. Um, and then, uh, come to find out that it was illegal. <laughs> yeah. And they chopped it in half. Oh, that's that's great. So I basically complained to the owner for a long time about it, and he eventually we had a conversation, we had a discussion, and he had the, this car. Um, it was originally it was white, 
at his uh, at his shop. And so, whenever we did all that, whenever we talked about it, we wind yeah. up coming to an agreement that he would that he'd give me this car. And uh, yeah, I just I lucked out. The paperwork that I have for this vehicle is astronomical. I mean, it's like <laughs> it's like literally whenever I have to do anything with DOT. Um, it's it's like going to court. I have to basically bring a briefcase full of paperwork and stuff, but um, everything's completely legal on the car. The car is 100 percent illegal. I get I get a lot of that. I don't know. Uh, legal or illegal? Legal. A lot legal. of it is legal. He 100%. said illegal. Oh, did I say illegal? <laughs> he said illegal. Look, I'm, I'm, become, I'm legal. starting to become you right now. Um, <laughs> I know I was messing up earlier. A lot of it is uh, uh, it, it's it was it was a pain in the butt to get everything done, but mm -hmm. eventually when I did get it done, it was worth it. Just clipping you here. Um, it was 100% worth it. I mean, like I said, I, I get to keep this car. This car's legal. I can take it anywhere I want to. Um, I get to have fun with it. Yeah. <laughs> the noise is definitely, uh, definitely great. Oh, yeah. So, so how much do you pay on insurance for this car? Um, I don't actually pay a lot, to be honest with you. Um, Haggerty um, is the insurance company that I go through. And they, uh... Because I pay like one... I pay $38 a month for my Skyline. Yeah, no, I wish I paid <laughs> And I pay $38. Uh, I will say this, in a six month clip with my insurance, six month clip with my insurance, I think I pay 1200 something like 1270 Yeah. I mean, that's not too bad considering, you know, the price of the car. Yeah, it's on this way. The price of the car and the, the rarity oh, here in the States. Exactly. Yeah, we are in the States, people. I know I have some Canadian viewers, I have some European viewers, some Australian viewers, and they're probably like, okay, yeah, it's a R34 <coughs> GTR or whatever. But yeah, we're actually in the States, so. Yeah, this is actually. Makes a big difference. Uh, this is pretty cool, though. This is a, uh, a cool experience. We'll make sure for all the all the naysayers that are wondering if it's actual v because I've, got, I've gotten plenty of that, too. Uh, one way to know if your car is a V-Spec or not, Intercooler temperature is on the gauge, so just to be clear with that, we have the intercooler temperature, so we know it's a V-Spec. Yes, it is a V-Spec. I, I think I mentioned that at the beginning of the video. I may have missed it, but there you go. So I know we're doing we're doing a video on the GTR, but I mean, look at this thing. Freaking right-hand drive Land Cruiser. Dang. He just pulled up. He saw us filming. He got some nice three-piece wheels on this thing. This thing is mint. He just pulled up wondering what we were doing, but I've never seen one of these right-hand drive. What year is this? 89. 89. Yeah, super clean. So now, he just let me drive this car. However, if you guys want to see that video, I'm probably going to do a separate video for that one, but it was an experience to say the least, but if you want to see that video, it'll probably be the next one I post. It was awesome. Though.